Caitlin, wake up. I know you talked about your blanket in a children's message, but I really didn't think you're still using it. Yeah, you know, after all these years, it just still brings me so much comfort. But ah, I must have fall, fallen asleep while I was writing in my discipleship journal. I try and write each week. It's so nice. There's a spot in here where you can write what you're grateful for and what you're looking forward to this week, and then a prayer list for people you want to pray for. So I try and do that each week, and I must have fallen asleep. Well, that's a good way to fall asleep, talking to God in prayer. I also wanted to talk to you Zion members about the prayer journal. The front part of it has for every worship service, every Sunday service, every Lenten service, a place for you to write down notes from the message, the verse of the day. So please bring these to church with you. Uh, they're available for you free. Pick one up if you don't have one yet. And then take your note, share it with your family members or share it with a friend and learn what you, are, what you both are learning from the Word. You know, I'm really glad you woke me up because I was having the craziest dream that it was Lent season already. <laughs> and believe me, it's only a couple weeks away. February 14th, Valentine's Day is Ash Wednesday. And the theme is, let my people go. We're going to walk through a good chunk of the book of Moses and see how God paints a beautiful picture of his amazing grace that we receive in Jesus. And uh, we invite you to come and be a part of that. Pastor Dan will be leading us in a good number of these worship services. We look forward to having you with us. And we also look forward to our soup suppers during Lent season. If you'd like to help out with the soup supper, there's a sign-up sheet in the hallway. And we have a couple dates open still. We have uh, February 21st, March 6th, and March 13th. If you would like to prepare the soup and serve it by yourself or with a friend, feel free to sign up. And we serve our soups at 5 p.m. each Wednesday. And while we are sad that Senior Pastor Guy is no longer here, this is a time we especially request your prayers for the staff, for Leadership Council, Building Committee, because they have more responsibilities laid on their shoulders, but we know God will provide because God's got this. He does. And if you'd like to volunteer during this time, we have a lot of volunteer opportunities. So stop by the office and um, share with what you're interested in and we can find a spot. Caitlin, did you hear that? No. That's my recliner calling. It's my turn. <laughs>